mic testing one two three this is the background noise mic testing one two three this is with rtx voice mic testing one two three this is the background noise now this is going to be with rtx on so i'm going to turn this to rtx voice and mic testing one two three this is with rtx voice so let's check the results mic testing one two three this is the background noise Mic testing one two three. This is okay. So first voice. you have to run the file that you download. Then after you have run it, exit it, and then go to C drive, and then click on this temp folder. Then this folder on the top, that NB AFX folder. Then this folder, and then right click on this and open it with a notepad. So after you have opened it with a notepad, you have to find this tag, this constraints tag in the in word file uh, and then you have to like delete that constraints tag and then you have to save it if you're unable to save it check the permissions now you have to open it directly from this setup.exe in this folder and uh, now you can just install it normally and then select your default input device Okay, so one thing that you have to keep in mind when you're using RTX voice on your laptop is that it will turn on the discrete graphics of your laptop. It will turn on your NVIDIA GPU. So what that means is that uh, it will consume way more battery than uh, when you were not using your uh, RTX voice on. So try to use it only when you need it and uh, only when you are connected to a power source because the integrated graphics do not have the CUDA ports that are required to run RTX voice. And uh, integrated graphics are also way more efficient than the, your GPU. Since uh, Intel HD620 is based on the 14 nanometer process, while uh, other low-end graphics, uh, discrete graphics processors like uh, the MX110 or the 130 or 150, probably 150 as well. So all of them are based on 28 nanometer process. So th because they are Maxwell series graphics, so they are going to be way less efficient and will generate way more heat and consume way more power. So lower battery life, more heat. And uh, so that's why you should only, you should only use RTX on when you really need it.